How are you going to be? Tell me, what do you feel about letting it go? You going to miss it? Any thoughts like that? Mm -hmm. Well, I've had the car for a, a while. I got to drive it. I enjoy driving it. Um, it's an awfully nice car. You know, but at this point in my life, if I'm going as fast as this car will go, I like to be in an airplane. <laughs> Great. You need to wash the car. I apologize for that. It is so beautiful. Yeah, the paint's in great shape on it. It's never been in an accident that I can tell, and I've been underneath this car, over it. I mean, you just look at the way, you know, the seams on the doors, <clears throat> all the clearances, the way the hood fits, the way the, the rear windshield fits, the fascia in the back. Um, it's the way it came from the factory. They're going to be a collector's car someday. I mean, the reason I bought the car was uh, thinking that, you know, it probably inflated and appreciated value. and. Um, at this point, uh, I think they're still depreciating. So at some point in the life expectancy of this car, they're going to turn around and be worth a lot of money. Start going back up. Oh, I think so, yeah. Okay, now how would you describe this car in like two or three words? Well, it's just totally awesome. It's uh, certainly the fastest car I've ever owned, fastest car I've ever driven. Um, but it's enjoyable too. It's got very good road manners. Very quiet inside. You can drive down the road at 70 miles an hour, listen to the radio. You can have a conversation with somebody inside of the car. Um, everything works on it. It's a perfect mechanical condition. I love the car. Anything you want to say to Jim, the new owner? Don't bend it, Jim. Be kind to it. Hug and rub it. It'll treat you right. <laughs> Thanks for the check, Jim.